So, 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 <laughs> so you want to be an actor. So you want to be an actor, huh? Well, let me ask you one question. Do you feel lucky, punk? Well, do ya? <laughs> well, if you feel lucky, then maybe you'll be lucky. But here's the thing. Acting does have a lot to do, has a lot to do with luck. But if you just don't want to rely on luck and you want to make things happen, you have to create your own stuff. Whether it's YouTube, whether it's short films, feature films, whatever you could think of. You're in the entertainment industry. You want to be an entertainer. So the main thing I could tell you is invest in some kind of camera that's decent. Or if you don't have a good camera, you don't want to buy another one if yours isn't that great then you're going to have to invest in a good lighting setup or something. Something to make your, your films, all that stuff look really nice. So, it's almost essential to have a camera anyway. I know cell phones work really well, but the sound, and you can only do so much unless you buy certain programs. But anyway, get a good camera. It'll pay for itself eventually. You'll probably end up shooting things for people. You'll probably take pictures for people because most of them... I mean, they don't just shoot video, they shoot pictures as well. So you could always do it as a little side hustle. But create your own stuff. And if you don't feel like you're very creative and your stuff's not good, don't worry about it. Just start someplace. Create, create, create. And the main thing is, is creativity can't be taught to you. There's not a class or anything that can really teach you to be creative. They could give you steps and all this stuff, but it really is up to you. And I believe that the things that make you creative are not being so worried about what people are going to think if you come up with these ideas. You can't be shy. You can't, uh, you can't put something out and be afraid. Or you can't not put something out because you're afraid that people are going to think it's dumb. You just got to... You got to come up with ideas, whether it's a good idea or a bad idea. Just get in the habit of coming up with stuff, coming up with solutions to things. Those are some good steps to take on being creative. And the more you do it, it's like anything. The more you do it, the better you get at it. So you got to create, create, create. That's the main thing about this one is creating your own content, creating your own, create your own little talk show. You want to be a talk show host? Create a talk show. You want to... Do action, create an action film, horror, drama, all that stuff. It's going to help you out. You're going to be meeting people. You could also create things with other people, collaborate. It's hard. I'll tell you one thing. It's hard to get together with other people to do stuff unless they're really dedicated the same way you are because everybody has their own lives. Everybody has their own stuff that they have to do, their jobs, whatever it is, and Time goes by fast, and the more you let it slip by, the the later it gets in the game, and you just want to always be doing something that you like and enjoy, and you want to put out there and be creative, create, create, and the only way you're going to be more creative is practicing that and just putting it into whatever it is that you do. So be creative, can't be taught to you. I'm sure there's classes out there, and hey, there's nothing against taking classes to help you become more creative. If you find something like that, look it up. Do your research. And you could always learn something from whatever it is that you take or do, I'm sure. So it wouldn't be a bad idea to check something out like that. Or go to your art museums. Watch old films. You're in the entertainment industry. There's tons of stuff. There's millions of movies. There's more movies than you could think. There's Netflix. All those different shows and stuff you could watch. Get ideas from them and just do it. That's the main thing is just stepping up, doing what it is that you got to do. And you're going to make something eventually. And other than just creating and putting it out there, I'll have to give you a little example of things that will also, besides just putting them on YouTube, whatever these uh, streaming services, devices, all these things like that, social network things, you want to create something and have a objective for it. So say you do create a short film. It's always a good idea to put it into 
a short film contest or short, not short film contest, a short film festival because that's a good way to network with other people. You never know who goes to watch these things. You never know if you win an award. If you really like the short film, you believe in it. Uh, some of them cost a lot more money than others, but I think it is a good idea to put your product into film festivals and see what you could get out of it. If you don't win awards, if you don't win any of that stuff for it, the other thing is you're going to get some networking out of it. And you got to make sure to talk to people, introduce yourself, get their business cards or contact info, however it is, just to stay in touch with them, to, to keep that circle of yours growing. So the creativeness will lead you to other things. And not only will it help you by creating your own content, but that's one of the main things too. It'll help your acting as well because as an actor you got to create these characters you got to create the story you got to they'll give you so much description most of the time when somebody gives you a character to play but you got to create everything around it to make that character believable and it's going to help you out and because the more you do it the better you're going to get at it the more ideas you're going to have you're going to feel less like oh man this is dumb you just got to be confident in your work. That's the main thing. You got to be confident. You got to create it. You got to do these things and make sure that you're putting them out there for people to see. So create your own work. Create your own content. Get it out there in film festivals. Put it out. Network. Those are some of the biggest things that will help you out. And it's the more you do it, the better you're going to get at it. Maybe you don't feel so confident at first starting off putting things out, but just keep doing it and keep putting it out there. Get, get advice from people. Show it to them. Don't be afraid. If they criticize it, it's hard not to take criticism bad because of our, I mean, you put a lot of work into something and somebody kind of shoots it down, whatever. It sucks, but you got, you got to look at it as that's a way to grow. That's a way to see like areas that you might not be so efficient in that you could work on. So if you're doing a film, you color, there's all kinds of different things. You learn from people, what they say about it, the camera angles, the lighting, the acting, whatever it is. You can learn a lot of stuff from people criticizing it. And that's good when they criticize it. That's a good thing. It's, it's not always easy to hear, but it's a real good thing just always be going and if uh, you got to use that criticism to uh, move forward in your work don't necessarily like I said don't necessarily take what they say to heart that it's exactly how it has to be but use it to further your own work so step up what it is in that area that you want to make better so it's gonna happen you got to just create it do it put it out there, not be so stuck on getting bad criticism. And even that, you know, the old saying, what they say is any publicity is good publicity. Even bad publicity is good publicity. If your piece of short film, whatever it is, is getting talked about a lot, hey, it's getting talked about more than the ones that nobody's even saying anything about or... Just like for a perfect example, that movie, The Room, how they did it to Disaster Artist. His movie was so horrible and random. People loved it for it being that. And it, did, it became like a joke. It became whatever, but it became popular. Got him noticed. So can't even say if you do something horribly bad that it might, it might blow up and people might enjoy it. So don't worry about it. If you care about it, if you like it, put it out there. If you truly believe in it, then do it. Be creative. Put it out there. It's one step to this whole huge process. I don't think you'll be disappointed. You'll learn a ton too. So just step up, get it out there, meet some people, work together, and I'm sure you'll come up with some great things. So like subscribe share keep growing keep learning and until next time i will see you later peace